but I want to talk about something that maybe most pastors aren't talking controversial about. Controversial. Yes, yeah. more controversial. Yeah. So you look at Carl Lentz, yeah. right? Carl Lentz, um, literally someone I looked up to when I first got saved. Yeah. Like I listened to his sermons yeah. all the time time i listened to that sermon called that girl is poison probably 500 times it might only have 2,000 views on youtube well not carl lentz 200,000 i was i was a thousand of them okay i'm telling you <laughs> but needs to say it came out maybe a week ago that um he had a moral mm -hmm. failure yeah. that um he cheated on his wife yeah right and, and i think to myself how did that happen so yeah practically i'm sure it started with small seeds of like just struggles or, or less but yeah why is it that when you're a pastor, you have to be so perfect? Yeah. Okay. So why couldn't he have talked about that struggle or yeah. may maybe he did, maybe he didn't, yeah. but it's almost like you can't mm -hmm. because there's this weight of like being perfect. Yeah. I don't know where that came from, Yeah. but I am the furthest thing from perfect. Yeah. Me too. You know bro. what I'm saying, bro? <laughs> yeah. Like I don't relate with perfection. Yeah. Yeah. I relate with brokenness yes. and then... God, I need you and my brokenness. Like yes, David, bro. one of our favorite people to talk about in the Bible. One of the you worst. Look at what he did, bro. <laughs> one of the worst. <laughs> <laughs> he was like, come on, dog. <laughs> and, and then like, I think it's Psalms 51, maybe something like that. He talked about God creating me a Pure new heart. heart. Yeah. And it's like, bro, what? I want to get to yeah. that place again. To like, yeah. God, creating me a new heart. Yeah, bro. Be